All right, Mark, thanks so much. And as he just mentioned, the Cedar River in Cedar Rapids is expected to crest Tuesday morning. However, the city and the people of Cedar Rapids, as Kristen was talking about, they've been preparing over the last several days. Storm Track 7 meteorologist Kyle Keel joins us now live in Cedar Rapids with an update. Kyle, you have been there all morning, all afternoon, and all night. Yeah, and it's Amanda, it's really amazing out here to see, uh, as we were mentioning earlier, just kind of people being in such a positive mood. As Ron was mentioning, you know, since Thursday, uh, the city has been uh, holding press conferences daily, uh, updating people on the preparations, and uh, that is because this river is forecast to crest at 23 feet here on Tuesday. And I was uh, speaking with a woman a little bit earlier today. We were just kind of talking, and she had mentioned to me that she had been here in the 2008 flood, had 17 feet in her home. And so I was like, well, what, what are you thinking of the preparation? And, and she told me and, and just got very overwhelmed with emotions. She's just so happy to see the city and the people coming together and helping one another out. So such a, a great thing to see. We saw a lot of people sandbagging in the Nubo area as well as the uh, Czech Village earlier today. As Kristen was mentioning earlier, here downtown, it's a pretty vacant out here. We've only seen uh, really a couple of people, a lot of uh, emergency vehicles uh, going around making sure that people are in fact heeding the, uh, the curfew that is in effect here until 7 o'clock in the morning and really we haven't seen much in the way of uh, people down here throughout the day so people are certainly taking this pretty seriously again uh, the river is forecast to crest at 23 feet here on Tuesday that would be the second highest crest on record of course we all know the the first highest crest was just eight years ago at 31.12 feet so certainly some good news that that forecast crest has gone down over the couple days but still major flooding forecast here at 23 feet on Tuesday and we will have uh, much more here of course tomorrow we've got you covered live in Cedar Rapids Kyle Keel KW. WWL News. All right, Kyle, thanks so much. Quick